so i am going to again talk about how to use uh, uh, r from excel so uh, there there were two things that i did here to install uh, the things that is to get uh, an add in that uh, would help me uh, get get things there uh so to i am going to talk about how to install this and how to use this uh, in into excel uh, that would probably help you uh, do a lot of fun stuff here in in the excel world uh, without getting into trouble but there is one disclaimer here uh, that this uh, uh, this r excel and this r connect uh, both of them uh, says that uh, they are for non commercial use but as a student or as a developer you can use them so uh, just be careful about that part uh, so i i have been talking about uh, how to use r into uh, excel because most of the people love excel they don't want to move anywhere other than excel and asking them to move into r is a is a little trickier part so now our reference frame has changed from r to excel we we are going to uh, use excel more or less but we are going to play around with uh, commands with uh, with things that would uh, go r get the work done and move back to excel the other way around uh, was in the excel connect where we would have said that we uh, we would go to excel get the things there and do all the computation in r so uh, the reference frame here is excel you would say this add in so you need to install two things to get uh, it uh, working the first is r excel and the second is dcom these two installation once you install these two installation you are good to go and you will get uh, uh the r thing now r can run on many instances so uh, th th that's an advantage of being uh, the lightweight uh, uh application that r would install and it would run on from excel where you don't need to worry about a lot of things so this this was uh, about my testing that i have started probably i'll come to you back uh, with uh, a lot of features here so you're going to start r then r output so let's start r so this r is a 32 bit uh and there is one reason r uh, also comes with a 32 bit thing uh, uh although this is a 64 bit that i was running on the other tab now you can uh, run a code uh, and and do anything that you would like to so the other part here is like load r file run that uh, and do a lot of play here so markels uh, are working directly load r file copy code debug put r arrays data frame run code disconnect a lot of thing let's uh, go there and to r excel help and see what they have given there so using r from within excel uh, and code repository from video embedded worksheet function so scrap mode macro mode right like macro in uh, the macro supplied by rxl attaching the macros attaching start new or process minute connect to server close r disconnect r copy r and so on so this was about the but but this is something that worked so i just wanted to bring it to uh, your excel but mind you this is not a free application you you go there and you see uh, uh, you will find that uh, this is uh, just for uh, uh, students So non-commercial users, but everything you are employ, or your employee does not wait for either excellent degree to become for the studying and learning and using software and for problem we don't provide. But in commercialization or education, your CP. So that was it.